Shortcuts have really increased my productivity on iOS and today I want to share with you guys 10 shortcuts that I use every single day on my iPhone 13 mini. So let's start. So the first shortcut is called New Calendar Event. So New Calendar Event is a great shortcut that allows you to um, add an event to your calendar setup. So the shortcut has it uh, set up to Fantastical, a great third party calendar application. So if you have an important date or something that you need to add and remember to your calendar date, you can quickly just use the shortcut to quickly add that a shortcut and then it will automatically allow you to write whatever you want and it will add it automatically to Fantastical or any other third party calendar app that you want to add to the shortcut when you edit it deep dive in the shortcut application. Next we have is new task. So new task is a fantastic a fantastic shortcut that allows you to quickly add any new task that you want. So you don't only have to add only one task, you can add multiple tasks in that line. So when you run the application, it, the shortcut will pop out and then all you have to do pretty much to add a new, uh, a new task is just uh, is just add click enter pretty much on the keyboard and then from there you can quickly add another task into the shortcut as well and it'll automatically add it to things a great third party application so if you haven't heard about things then i highly recommend you guys go check out that application on ios and so you can quickly add all those uh, all those tasks onto things well it will save them into the new inbox area on the application moving on we have is reflect on the day so reflect on the day is a great shortcut that allows me to reflect during the day. So when I, when, whenever I click the shortcut and run it, it will ask me some questions of how I'm feeling today, um, what was new today, what 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 did I do today, um, what, what's the plan for tomorrow, and everything. So it will just ask you all these questions. You can just answer them really quickly with one word or two words, and that's pretty much it. And then it will save your reflect today on the notes application so that you can check and reflect back um, of how you were feeling and how you were on that day. So it's a really fantastic app that I use a lot to just reflect on my day. Um, it's like a mini little quick journal on the iPhone 13 mini. Next we have is break timer. So working from home of course has changed a lot of people's lives and everything and of course uh, you got to be a little bit much more productive of course when you work from home and this shortcut is really great because it allows me to add timers to my break so if I wanted to go for a lunch break or maybe just read a little bit or go for a snack I could quickly just go and choose what type of break I want, I'm going to go for so if I go for a lunch it's going to usually be one hour lunch break so I quickly click, uh, click on the on the shortcut and then click on what type of break I'm taking and then from there it'll automatically start the timer on the clock app so that it counts down for one hour so that I know that I only have to take one hour lunch break and that's pretty much it. So it's a really great uh, uh, application just to keep track of your breaks of course and so that you don't go over it too much um, when you're working from home. Next is a simple shortcut called log water. Now, of course, if you drink a lot of water, then you're you're pretty much okay. But if you like to track your water like me, your water intake, then it's a really cheap and easy way to do it. It's it, You could just choose from the, the list that you run it. So it will choose you how many ounces of water you've, you've taken. And then from there, uh, automatically uh, add it to the health application so that you could keep track of your water intake as well. And it just makes it really easy of course to um, uh, follow your water intake using this shortcut application next we have is uh, add reminders so this is where you can add a batch of reminders so let's say you're going to the grocery store or something you click on the shortcut when you're running it and it'll ask you what type of list you want to add it so let's say you go to the grocery store it'll, uh, you could make it the, uh, the list called groceries and then from there you could quickly add all the items that you need to be reminded about when you're going out to the grocery store of what you need to buy and everything so that you don't forget and come back home so yeah it's just a really fantastic uh, shortcut right here um, to quickly just remind yourself and I really enjoy it because I use this a lot because you know I sometimes I forget stuff in the store so I quickly just write down whatever I need and then from there I go to the store and open the notes app from there or the reminders application sorry and then I can quickly see what I need to buy for that day. 
Next is one of my favorite shortcuts that I like just to check for fun, and that is the how many days until. So this date, uh, or this shortcut allows you to quickly just add a special date. So let's say somebody's birthday, or it's a special event, or maybe Christmas or something. Then you quickly just run the shortcut, will it'll automatically tell you how many days until Christmas, um, which is really great, of course, since it's November, so it's pretty much almost a month and so um, until Christmas. Next, we have this tech news. So tech news is a great shortcut that I like to use. Of course, I'm a techie, you know that. So I like to check, of course, what type of news I'm going to be seeing on the Apple News application. So when you run the app, it will automatically open the Apple News application and it will take me to the news uh, section of the technology section to quickly follow up and see what's happening in the tech world in the news area. So yeah, it's just I really enjoy that uh, shortcut right there. And then we have image of the day. So image of the day just shows you pictures of space. So it's really cool. Um, it, one day you could be looking at the Milky Way, satellites, Earth, stars, sun. So it's just a really fun shortcut just to have, just to remind yourself of what's out there in space. And next and not least, we have Apple Frames. So Apple Frames allows me to quickly create uh, frames uh, whenever I take screenshots on the iPhone 13 mini. I can make a screenshot of that and make a frame out of the iPhone 13 mini as well, which is really great, of course. You've probably seen a lot of those frames on YouTube thumbnails that I create and everything. So yeah, I just really enjoy using this and running it as well uh, a lot. It has saved me a lot of time as well whenever I need to make a thumbnail. So that's pretty much it for the top uh, uh, um, shortcuts that I use every single day uh, that help my workflow and everything and improve my workflow on the iPhone 13 mini. Of course, if you guys really enjoy this video, it means the world to me. If you guys will hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. As always, I will see you guys later. Peace.